good morning everybody so um i thought today that i would film a what i eat in a day video as i haven't filled one of these in a very long time so and now i'm feeling a lot more normal human whatever i'm feeling a lot better so i thought i would film one i'm going to be using my bullet journal because i've planned a lot of meals from here so this is what i'm going to use today and unfortunately lunches i've already prepped i prepped lunches last night but you will still see what i'll be eating so we're gonna get straight on in and start with breakfast so going into my bullet journal so I've put some weight on since having this relapse and I want to get it off because I used to weigh 12 stone 6 and now I've put a stone on exactly well a stone and a bit so I need to get it off because I felt healthier when I was slimmer and need to sort that out so I've devised my little own weight loss plan because slimming world I love I'm still going to be like eating the Slimming World ready meals and all that stuff but it was just difficult getting to group it stayed late and I just thought I need to try something else myself so cutting out uh, junk and portion control so making sure my portions are smaller than what I have been eating started yesterday I said I was going to start yesterday but you know my breakfast was held my breakfast was fine didn't have a salad for lunch and we had a takeaway because it was my mum's and George's birthday so yesterday was a bit of a, a write-off but today for breakfast I'm going to be doing porridge with raspberries and strawberries so we will get on with that. Lunch is a falafel salad which I've already prepared and dinner is a Slimming World ready meal with some veg or salad. I can't decide which meal to have yet. And then for snacks today I will have apple, mango, I might, and then either crackers or a snack bar. So either or, but not both. So let's get started with some breakfast. So as a lot of you know, if you follow me on my Instagram page, you know that every morning I have porridge for breakfast. Every single morning, apart from the rare occasions. So I have half a cup of porridge oats, and these are just your standard normal porridge oats that I keep in my little jar here and then I with that I add um, one cup of water and bring that to the boil and let that cook away so there is half a cup of porridge oats and one cup of water I have not add I never add cook my porridge with milk I only cook it with water and then I'm going to be adding some strawberries and some frozen raspberries. To make it creamy, I followed this girl called Liesl Jane on YouTube. And she taught me a really healthy way to make your um, porridge creamy. And that's adding one flat teaspoon of coconut oil. So I'll do that. I'm then going to add in some cinnamon, which I need more of. One teaspoon of almond butter flat teaspoon and one flat teaspoon of maple syrup and uh, put it all together so that's what I'm going to do once my porridge is, is cooked it's just happily cooking away there but what I also have in the mornings is one of these vitamin C high strength uh, tablets um, I just dissolve it in water and I drink one glass of that and then what I'm also doing at the moment is having two teaspoons of this stuff, which is called ferroglobin. Um, so it's got obviously coenzyme Q10, vitamin D, don't know what the other one is, um, gentle iron, folic acid, vitamins B12, tiredness and fatigue. So I'm, I'm I've been taking this to see if it will help with uh, my MS fatigue and things like that. So... Uh, George and I haven't been taking it very long, so we're just going to see how it goes. But yeah, just going to have this and drink my vitamins.
everyone, I'm back. I've put some makeup on, I've done some nice eye makeup today. I'm gonna have some lunch now and I can actually say it's, what time is it? Let's have a look. It's half, just gone half past one and I haven't eaten anything since breakfast this morning at 10 o'clock. So that's just goes to show how much porridge actually fills me up. But in the lunch menu on in my bullet journal here, we are gonna be having a falafel salad. And I said to you earlier, by the way, sorry if you can hear the noise, I've just put a wash on. I actually pre-made it, so it's already in the fridge, ready to go. So let's have a look. I have got my lunch all pre-made in this amazing lunch box that I got from Amazon. It's like a little bento box, but not kind of thing. So open the lid. So I've got a bit of mango. I've got a baby bell. There is my salad, so I'm going to dig into this and enjoy it. But also, I found on Iceland's website these Capri Sun uh, No Added Sugar drinks. Um, I just had a look on the uh, box and it said they were 10 calories, but looking on the side here, they're 5 calories. So, if any of you Slimming Worlders are out there, I wonder if these are free on Slimming World, but I'm not on Slimming World anymore, but... These would be perfect for like lunches or, you know, just a little treat and because um, they're amazing. But yeah, no added sugar Capri Suns from Iceland. So yeah, see if they're free on Swimming World because they're great. All right, I'm going to eat my lunch because I'm pretty starving now. So I'll see you at dinner or later if I have a snack. Bye. I'm sorry and I'm back because I'm rubbish and I totally forgot to tell you what was actually in here. So as you can see, obviously there's um, falafel balls that I just bought from... Asta. I've got some um, reduced fat hummus, some carrot shavings, I've got some lettuce, cucumber, sweet corn tomatoes, um, beetroot and some spring onions I think in there and in, in my bullet journal it said whether I was going to have some crisps, well some cracker, low fat crackers or a snack with this so I decided to have a treat. I'm going to have a treat because I'm a chocoholic so here we have two little Oreo biscuits I'm going to have and I'm not going to have the crackers so Oreo biscuits instead of the crackers and now I'm watching Conjuring 2 so I'm going to go and enjoy this and Arthur says hi. Say hi. <laughs> Alright I'm going to go and eat my lunch. See you later. I'm going to make myself a cup of tea now because this is what I eat in a day video so that includes drinks as well. Here is my disorganised tea cupboard. I'm going to have a... I love this tea. I need to make sure this is all tidy and stuff soon. I'm going to have a pucker three mint tea because like that lunch that I had was amazing but I feel really like bloated now but one of these tea bags sorts me out. So yeah, so I might, I'm going to go and sit down for a bit upstairs. Might do some of my bullet journal and watch bit more of my film that I was watching earlier and um, have my cup of tea. I'm not going to eat anything. I won't eat anything now until dinner because I'm so full up. I'm not even going to want my apple snack that I'd put as a snack. So um, I might have that as a dessert. Um, my apple, an apple. So yeah, and do that. And then I guess guys, I'm going to see you at dinner. So I'm going to go and have my tea and chill out for a bit so I'll see you all later at dinner. Bye! Hello guys. So, sorry Arthur's playing up, aren't you? Do you want your dinner? <laughs> he wants his dinner too. Um, so yeah, I've come downstairs now because I'm starting to get a bit peckish and I thought I would sort something out for my dinner. So, I'm going to have a Slimming World ready meal but I'm not going to have the whole thing I'm going to oh I'm going to do have half for my tea and then I'm going to do another half for the rest for George for his lunch tomorrow so there you go let's so make sure I'm not covering the the microphone um I don't fancy chicken chow mein because I had Chinese last night so it might be contenders might be the sausage casserole Oh, I do like the sound of chicken in black bean sauce, though. That sounds really tasty as well. Mm. It's between these two meals is what I'm going to be having. And I think I'm going to have that one. 
chicken and black bean sauce because I could do some frozen broccoli and some rice. Jobs are good and bish bash bosh where I was with that one. I need to do potato and, and all that jazz. So that's for lunch. That's for dinner another. Sorry, that's for dinner for me and lunch for George for tomorrow. That's for dinner another night. Cool, I'm going to start getting these prepped and get your dinner too. Yes, you can have your dinner as well. Yes. Right, let's get these prepped, yeah? And here we are, guys. So I've had chicken in black bean sauce from the Slimming World Ready Meal range. And I added um, a half a pack, well, not even half a pack, a quarter of a pack of Tilda coconut rice and some broccoli. This is actually a small plate. Um, my big plates are in here because I'm trying to control my portion sizes so this is like an or like a normal sized fork and that's this is how small the plate is or that's my hand and that's the plate so yeah I'm just trying to do some portion control so I'm not eating so much but yeah I'm gonna dig into this now and see what it's like and then um I might have a little dessert I don't know yet we'll see if I'm full from this or not okay so I'll see you in a bit and dinner is devoured and it was really tasty actually it was really really yummy um i'd highly recommend the chicken and black bean sauce ready meal by slimming world it was delicious and then i added some rice a little bit of rice and <coughs> excuse me some broccoli um so that was really really nice and i always like to have a little dessert i'm gonna do that so the first snack that i've made i'll just flip you around here you are. So this is a, I don't know what apple it is. I think it's a, just a, a golden apple. Um, and with some pea, with some reduced fat peanut butter in there. And then if we head on over to the freezer, this is going to be a little snack for in a bit once it's frozen over. I've got one banana with one tablespoon of Nutella. So I'm just letting that solidify in there. So... Um, after these snacks I won't be eating anything else um, I hope you enjoyed this what I eat in a day video like I said before I will leave my uh, blog in by blog link in the description bar below for you all to check out because I will be writing about this as well so go ahead and check that out please give this video a great big thumbs up if you liked it and if you're new to my channel and you enjoyed this video and would like to see more what I eat in a day videos please hit that lovely red subscribe button which is usually just next to my face leave me any comments in the comment section bar below and I will be sure to answer them if you want me to do another what I eat in a day video or any other recommendations just let me know and I'll see what I can do for you have a lovely evening guys take care